What if one of history's greatest inventors revealed that the Bible contained hidden scientific knowledge? This isn't just another conspiracy theory. It's a brilliant inventor's radical vision that could change everything we think we know about science and spirituality. Tesla believed that Jesus wasn't just a spiritual leader. He was an advanced scientist who understood the laws of nature in ways that seemed miraculous to others. This perspective reframes Jesus' miracles not as supernatural occurrences, but as demonstrations of profound scientific knowledge far ahead of his time. Walking on water, for instance, might be explained by an advanced understanding of surface tension or manipulation of gravitational fields. Healing the sick could be achieved through precise control of the body's electromagnetic fields or cellular vibrations. Even the transformation of water into wine might be viewed as a form of molecular restructuring or energy transmutation. But here's where things get really crazy. Tesla's speculation about Jesus' healing abilities being related to vibrational medicine is particularly intriguing. Modern research has shown that specific frequencies can indeed influence cellular behavior and promote healing. If Jesus possessed an intuitive or learned understanding of these principles, he may have been able to induce healing effects that appeared miraculous to observers. Extending this perspective to other biblical miracles, Tesla's interpretations become even more thought-provoking. The parting of the Red Sea, traditionally viewed as a divine intervention, could be recast as Moses' exploitation of a natural phenomenon. Perhaps he understood tidal patterns or seismic activities in a way that allowed him to predict. This doesn't diminish the significance of the event, but rather paints Moses as a keen observer and manipulator of natural forces. What if the line between miracle and undiscovered science is blurrier than we think? What secrets of the universe might be hiding in ancient texts, waiting for us to decode them with modern knowledge? The feeding of the multitude, where Jesus supposedly fed thousands with just a few loaves of fish, takes on a new dimension through Tesla's lens. If we consider the possibility of matter-energy conversion or some form of rapid cellular replication, the miracle becomes a demonstration of advanced physics rather than divine provision. These interpretations challenge us to reconsider the nature of miracles and the intersection of science and spirituality. They suggest that what we perceive as miracles may simply be science we don't yet understand. This perspective doesn't necessarily negate the divine, but rather proposes that the divine might work through natural laws in ways we're only beginning to comprehend. Tesla's ideas also raise intriguing questions about the nature of ancient wisdom. If figures like Jesus and Moses possessed such advanced scientific knowledge, where did it come from? Was there an ancient civilization with technology far beyond what we typically associate with that era? Or were these individuals simply gifted with extraordinary intuitive understanding of the universe's fundamental principles? Well, here's where things get really crazy. Tesla's unconventional view of the Bible doesn't stop with Jesus and individual miracles. He saw the entire text as a cosmic puzzle box filled with encoded scientific knowledge waiting to be deciphered. This perspective transforms the Bible from a purely religious text into a potential repository of ancient wisdom that could rival or even surpass our modern understanding. In Tesla's eyes, biblical stories weren't just moral teachings or historical accounts. They were metaphors for complex scientific principles. The creation story in Genesis, for example, wasn't a literal account of divine creation, but a symbolic representation of how order emerges from chaos, a concept that aligns with our current understanding of complex systems and spontaneous organization in physics and chemistry. Even more intriguingly, Tesla speculated that the story of Noah's Ark might contain hidden knowledge about advanced navigation and engineering techniques. Could the dimensions and design specifications of the Ark encode mathematical ratios or architectural principles that were far ahead of their time? This interpretation paints a tantalizing picture of ancient civilizations possessing sophisticated scientific knowledge that's been lost to time. Central to Tesla's radical interpretation of the Bible was his concept of cosmic energy or ether, an all-pervasive energy he believed was key to unlocking the universe's deepest secrets. 
In Tesla's view, Jesus wasn't just aware of this energy, he was a master at manipulating it, using his profound understanding to perform what appeared to be miracles. This perspective doesn't just reframe Jesus as a scientific figure. It suggests that we all might have untapped potential to achieve the seemingly impossible. If Jesus could harness cosmic energy to perform miracles, could we potentially do the same with the right knowledge and understanding? It's a thought that blurs the line between the miraculous and the scientifically advanced, challenging us to reconsider the limits of human potential. What if the stories we've dismissed as myths or legends actually contain kernels of advanced scientific understanding? Could the miracles described in religious texts be early observations of natural phenomena we're only now beginning to comprehend? These questions open up fascinating avenues for exploration, bridging archaeology, physics, and religious studies in unprecedented ways. In a world often divided between science and faith, Tesla's unique perspective offers a bridge. It invites us to see the Bible not just as a religious text, but as a potential treasure map to lost knowledge. It challenges us to approach miracles not with blind faith or dismissive skepticism, but with curious scientific minds. This perspective invites us to look at familiar stories and teachings in a completely new light. What if the parables of Jesus weren't just moral lessons, but encoded scientific principles? What if the prophets of the Old Testament weren't just speaking metaphorically, but describing real phenomena that science is only now beginning to understand? Let's take a pause here for a moment, because things are about to take an unexpected turn. Tesla's idea about the Bible and Jesus are undoubtedly controversial. They challenge both traditional religious beliefs and established scientific theories, but they also open up fascinating possibilities. What if, by understanding the science behind Jesus' miracles, we could unlock new healing technologies? What if decoding the hidden knowledge in the Bible could lead to breakthroughs in physics or energy production? Whether you see Tesla's theories about the Bible and Jesus as brilliant insights or fascinating speculation, they undoubtedly push us to think beyond our current paradigms. And in a world facing complex challenges, maybe that's exactly what we need. A perspective that bridges the gap between science and spirituality, inviting us to see familiar stories in a new light and imagine possibilities we've never considered before. Building on Tesla's revolutionary ideas about the Bible and Jesus, we can explore even deeper implications of this perspective. If the Bible indeed contains encoded scientific knowledge, it raises profound questions about the nature of human history and our understanding of technological progress. Consider the possibility that ancient civilizations possessed advanced scientific knowledge that was subsequently lost or hidden. This idea aligns with various theories about lost civilizations like Atlantis or advanced prehistoric societies. If Tesla's interpretations are correct, it would suggest that human knowledge doesn't always progress in a linear fashion, but might instead follow cycles of discovery, loss, and rediscovery. The concept of cyclical knowledge ties into many ancient philosophies and religious traditions that speak of golden ages followed by periods of decline. Tesla's ideas about biblical wisdom could be seen as supporting these cyclical views of history and human progress. It challenges our modern assumption that we are at the pinnacle of human knowledge and suggests that ancient peoples may have understood aspects of reality that we are only now rediscovering. Tesla's perspective on Jesus as a master of cosmic energy or ether also has intriguing parallels with various esoteric and mystical traditions. Many spiritual practices speak of manipulating subtle energies or achieving altered states of consciousness. If Jesus were indeed manipulating some form of universal energy to perform miracles, it could provide a scientific basis for understanding these mystical practices. But this is where things get truly shocking. This view of Jesus as a scientific adept rather than a spiritual leader also raises interesting questions about the nature of spiritual enlightenment. Could what we consider spiritual awakening actually be a form of advanced scientific understanding? 
Might meditation and other spiritual practices be methods for tapping into and manipulating the same cosmic energies that Tesla believed Jesus controlled? Furthermore, Tesla's ideas about biblical miracles being based on advanced scientific principles could potentially reconcile long-standing conflicts between science and religion. If miracles are simply applications of natural laws we don't yet understand, it removes the need to choose between scientific rationality and religious faith. This perspective could pave the way for a more integrated worldview that embraces both scientific inquiry and spiritual experience. The implications of Tesla's theories extend beyond just reinterpreting past events. If the Bible truly contains advanced scientific knowledge, it could potentially guide future scientific research. Tesla's speculation about Noah's Ark containing advanced engineering knowledge is particularly intriguing in light of modern environmental challenges. Could the Ark story encode principles of sustainable design or technologies for surviving ecological disasters? As we face growing environmental threats, any hidden wisdom about living in harmony with nature could be invaluable. The idea of the Bible as a repository of lost scientific knowledge also raises ethical questions. If such knowledge exists, who should have access to it? How should it be used? The Bible itself contains cautionary tales about the misuse of power and knowledge. If we were to unlock the scientific secrets Tesla believed were hidden in its pages, we would need to consider the responsibilities that come with such knowledge. Tesla's perspective also invites us to reconsider other ancient texts and traditions. If the Bible contains encoded scientific knowledge, might the same be true of our other religious or mythological texts? This could open up new avenues of research, combining the study of ancient languages and cultures with cutting-edge scientific inquiry. The potential parallels between Tesla's theories and modern scientific concepts are also worth exploring. For instance, his idea of an all-pervasive cosmic energy bears some resemblance to modern concepts in quantum physics, such as the quantum field or zero-point energy. Could Tesla's intuitions about the nature of reality, inspired by his interpretation of biblical texts, have anticipated discoveries in theoretical physics? Moreover, Tesla's view of Jesus as a master of energy manipulation resonates with emerging fields like bioelectromagnetics and energy medicine. As we learn more about the body's electromagnetic properties and the role of energy in healing, we might gain new insights into the scientific basis of Jesus' reported healing abilities. The notion of hidden knowledge in the Bible also aligns with modern ideas about information theory and data compression. Could the biblical authors have used sophisticated methods to encode vast amounts of information into seemingly simple stories and passages? This perspective invites a whole new approach to biblical scholarship, one that combines traditional textual analysis with techniques from cryptography and data science. Tesla's ideas also challenge us to reconsider the role of intuition and inspiration in scientific discovery. If figures like Jesus and Moses had access to advanced scientific knowledge through intuitive or spiritual means, it suggests that scientific understanding can come through channels other than formal experimentation and logical deduction. This aligns with accounts of many scientific breakthroughs coming through dreams, sudden insights, or altered states of consciousness. Whether or not one accepts Tesla's specific theories, his approach exemplifies the kind of interdisciplinary, boundary-pushing thinking that often leads to major breakthroughs. By daring to see ancient wisdom through the lens of modern science and vice versa, we open ourselves to new possibilities and potentially transformative insights.